good morning everybody it's tony roten here and it is facebook live thursday and i'm so excited to come to you again on a wonderful thursday thank you for showing up thank you for being willing to watch and to learn and to apply these principles in your life and these techniques that i've discovered throughout my life and for being willing just to want to improve yourself. I say this every week, but I tell it because I get new people is I never know it's not scripted. I don't have a teleprompter or anything like that. I try to tap in with you to see what it is that you need. And the thing that's coming to me this morning is the importance of being a parent. Now, we have wonderful children, absolutely wonderful children. The problem that we run into, though, is we have too many parents that are wanting to be friends. Now, there's a time and a place to be a friend, and there's a time and a place to be a parent. And the other day, it was a video I watched. This kid just starts throwing a fit. And starts yelling at his, his parents, starts, you know, saying F you and all this. And I was like, holy cow, where's the, where's the, there's parent responsibility here in teaching that kid that that is not okay. We've lost a lot of our traditional values. And with those traditional values comes the respect that women deserve and parents deserve. The other day, I saw a guy who, he gets in the car, and his wife is carrying a child and groceries, and this guy isn't carrying anything. He walks over, gets in his car, and he's telling her to hurry up. Are you kidding me? Where's the respect? Where's the treating your your wife, your girlfriend, your daughter like a queen, like a princess, that needs to come back. But you women, you need to demand it. You need to help these guys realize that it's not okay to be a dirtbag, that you, they need to respect you, they need to love you, they need to care for you, they need to cherish you and support you. And this has nothing to do with saying that you're lower or, or not. This has everything to do with showing you respect and showing you the, the love that you deserve and that you should be given on a regular basis. If we were to start bringing that back, your value and your worth would shoot up tremendously. You, you wouldn't be thinking any less of yourself. And I hope you do that. And start with your children. You let them know that you deserve that respect. My mom used to always say, I brought you into this world, I take you out this world. <laughs> I know she's joking, but it's true. You've gone through a lot of pain and suffering and sorrow and misery to bring this child into this world. And now just let them know that, hey, I deserve that respect. And don't tolerate anything less. Now, I'm not saying you have to beat them or abuse them or anything like that. That, that is not, I don't want you to think that that's what I'm talking about. But there are consequences that come when they don't show you respect. Maybe you could be pulling weeds. Maybe it could be you know, sweeping, what? there's all kinds of things. Make them work for you. Oh my gosh, I said that word, work. So many people, it's, it's like that's a bad word. Work is a good thing, and we need to teach our children how to do it. We need to teach our children the skills, the talents necessary. In all things, not just in manual labor, but also intellectual, 
financial, spiritual, emotional, social. Our children are bombarded on a daily basis, and so are you. I mean, we get hammered from these people saying this and those people saying that. and I mean, you just get all kinds of voice, most of it negative, and especially being on Facebook. Oh, my gosh. I realize I'm kind of involved with pol political stuff, and I realized that I started really getting agitated, and every time I'd hear certain people's names, I would just, oh, I could feel the blood boil in my skin, and I'm like, that's just not right. That's just not right. Just because somebody else, you know, does make a mistake that I feel is one of the dumbest mistakes in the world, I shouldn't allow that to boil or to make me so upset that it affects the way I am the rest of the day or the way I am towards my children, my family, because I'm so agitated. And it's so important that we learn to process those emotions. I know I keep going over that and over and that, over and that again and again. But it's true. We need to process those emotions so that, that we don't carry them on to somebody else or to a loved one especially. But thank you so much for listening. I really, that's all I really have for you. Unless there's anybody on here who has a question. I know I've seen a few people pop in. And you are amazing. Demand the respect that you deserve. You deserve to be treated like a queen like a princess, nothing less. You're amazing. Believe it. Have a fantastic day.